And welcome back to the channel. On this video, I thought I would talk a little bit about bikes on the road and the rules of the road, but not the bikes knowing the rules of the road, but how about cars knowing the bike rules of the road? I think bikes get a bad rap, or cyclists get a bad rap, um, and uh, blame for uh, whenever there's a situation on the road. And I think it's time to uh, have cars or motor vehicles um, know what bikes can do on the road and are allowed to do on the road. Whether motor vehicles like it or not, bikes and cyclists are allowed on the road just like they are. And whether you agree with that or not, you have to uh, abide by that. And so I think that we need to all share the road and get along uh, sharing the road. So a few things that I've thought about with this is that and looked up as well and was reading about this too uh, some of the rules of the road and so the yield law so cars must yield to cyclists in bike lanes and do they always no i'm not saying they never do but uh, oftentimes i've had situations where uh, the bike is just kind of like an afterthought there. They don't even half the time pay attention to you and know you're there and they need to know you're there. And so drivers should be yielding before turning across the bike lane. Like I uh, was saying, I've had times where I've been cut off before. I've been going along, not at excessive speeds or anything, in the bike lane, and had a car cut in front of me and do his right turn. Not let me go by first. He gets in front and then proceeds to do his right turn. So another one um, that cars need to know, I'm saying cars, but we're talking motor vehicles. I'm just saying cars, but it could be truck or, or anything, any motor vehicle. So the passing laws, So they should allow, there should be at least three feet of distance when passing a bike or a cyclist. And I really think another thing that they need to do is, uh, I don't know whether you'll agree with me on this one is, I think the bike lanes, first of all, I don't, I wish they weren't even on the road and they had designated bike lanes so we wouldn't have to deal with this, but I don't know if that's ever gonna be, you know, you may get lucky where you are and have some of them, but I don't know if we'll ever get to the point, at least for sure not in my lifetime, of uh, designated bike lanes all over, or even have some of them. Um, but uh, I think the bike lanes are really not wide enough. Call me crazy, but I think I, there's been times when you can almost feel that truck going by you pretty close, you know. And uh, sometimes, and I pointed this out in the past, some of the mirrors can stick out quite a bit on some vehicles. I think there should be, the bike lane should be a little wider. But that's just myself, uh, my thoughts. But if you want to comment and have any ideas yourself on what we're talking about today, go ahead and leave that in the comments below. And here's one 
that I don't like that cars do, but they do it, and that's parking in the bike lane. So the rule, the law, stipulates that drivers should not park or drive in bike lanes. The only time they can cross a bike lane is to if they're uh, going to be turning right and they have to get into the right, as we spoke of earlier, but just don't cut the, the cyclist off doing so. Or uh, if they are unloading cargo or loading cargo, then they have the right to be there. Or the other uh, situation would be if their car or truck or whichever becomes disabled, then that's different. But other than that, they should not be in the bike lane and oftentimes, and probably you've seen it too, if you're a cyclist, be it e-bike or, or traditional cycle, uh, people parking their vehicles in the bike lane. I've seen that lots of times. And it, especially at night, I think it's even worse if you're a night rider. I don't do a lot of night riding, so it doesn't affect me so much, but I'm sure I know that there's a lot of you out there that do. Some even say they only exclusively ride at night because there's less traffic on the road. Um, but some that commute, you may be going to, to work in the dark, you may very well be coming home in the dark also. And um, parked cars in the bike lane can be dangerous. So that's, that's the one probably that bugs me the most. And the other one that bugs me, it's got nothing to do with cars, uh, really. Well, it might have, because maybe it's from them that some of this goes in there, but uh, debris. Uh, I guess it comes off of the cars and blows into the uh, bike lane, but I, I really uh, not a fan of the debris in the bike lane. And there's times that I don't want to even ride in the bike lane. I prefer to ride in the car lane if I can, just for that simple fact that there's so much debris in there that uh, you almost refuse to ride in it. It can be so bad, it can be that bad. Um, sometimes when I've done videos, um, some people will say, well, I don't see anything. Well, I don't think the camera always picks up what I see with the naked eye. I mean, glass, for one, uh, in the bike lane. Like I've gone sometimes in situations uh, on the bike lane or in the bike lane where there obviously has been an accident and uh, there's glass and the glass doesn't even all get picked up. So, um, and then you're forever dodging glass and oftentimes you gotta come out of the bike lane uh, because of that. So let's clean up those bike lanes. That's, that's another one that really bugs me, but all right, well, that's going to do it for this video. Hey, if you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button. If you'd like to subscribe to the channel, thank you very much for supporting us. Just hit that subscribe button. If you want to be notified as to when the next video comes up on the channel, just hit the notification bell. And if you want to comment on this video or any others, maybe you've got, um, your, uh, some opinions or, uh, comments you'd like to add to this topic, uh, go ahead and leave those in the comments below. And thanks again for joining me on this video. And until next time, keep your wheels on the road. See you later.